What's up y'all, it's your girl B and I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be trying a bunch of new products y'all from the main choice. Um, I have some products from their new pile collection and I also have some oldies that I think they are revamping well one thing that I think that they're doing that with and then I have another product from an old line um the first product I'm going to be trying is from their boosting kit I found this on Ulta recently like a couple weeks ago and it said it was new so and I've never seen this before from them it's their mocha and molasses anti-shedding remedy um it's like a pre-poo you're supposed to apply it to dry hair so that's what I'm going to be doing first um, and I'm going to be co-washing with their PAL conditioner. Uh, then I'm going to be deep conditioning with their exotic Kool-Aid fresh mango and passion fruit, uh, hair mask. And then I'm going to be styling with the PAL gel. Okay. So everything is new. I've never tried any of this before. And I'm excited to see what's going to happen with my hair, y'all. Uh, my hair has been shedding to me a little more than normal. So when I saw the little anti-shedding thing, of course, I had to try it. Um, so, yeah, I want to see what's going to happen. I'm going to section my hair into four like I normally do. Uh, and it says to do it on dry hair, but I'm going to wet it a little bit just well, I'm, I'm probably going to try it on dry hair first. And then if I need to wet it, then I'll wet it a little bit. So let's jump right into it, y'all. You OPN, bitch, you won't be We should be closer than friends. If you OPN, Engaging you's on my agenda Request my chariot to get ya The doors open Take that high road and hop in Open up, up. open up Shut it down like a bag of Open up Alright y'all, so it's been about 30 minutes. I'm going to take this out. And I just want to see what my hair is feeling like and looking like. Um, the instruction said it stops shedding immediately. So I just want to see what my hair is looking and feeling like. Um... um doesn't really feel like much. Um, maybe once I rinse it out, I'll be able to feel a little something. Because I'm still shedding. I'm still shedding, guys. So, let me go and rinse this out. And maybe I'll be able to feel a difference in how my hair feels because right now it don't feel special at all. Just feels like I did a pre-poo. So I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So I just rinsed the mocha and molasses treatment out of my hair and um, it felt nice. I wasn't impressed um, my hair just feels really soft and nice but that's about it uh, this is probably something that I'm gonna have to use a few times before I actually see a difference because as I was rinsing it out uh, I'm still shedding I mean not a lot but I'm still shedding I'm still shedding so yeah this may be something that I'm gonna have to use a few times before actually seeing some major results 
but my hair does feel nice and that's about it see so all right next I'm going to be trying the pow conditioner uh, I'm gonna be using this to co-wash let's see Open up, you open up, hit you on baby M. We should be closer than friends. If you open up, engaging you on my agenda. Request my chariot to get ya. The doors open up, take that high road and hop in. Open up, open up, open up. I just rinsed out the conditioner and hold on. And I liked it. I really, really, really liked it. Uh, it was very softening, um, very slippery. Uh, my hair feels nice and clean and very, very soft. Ooh, got something in my hair. In my, uh, my hair feels really nice. Um, yeah, I like it. Um, now. This does have dimethicone in it, guys, but in the conditioner, um, it's like the, let's see, it's the fifth to last ingredient. It's all the way at the bottom. It's somewhere, yes. It's all the way at the bottom of the ingredient list. That is the only reason why I purchased it. Um, the deep conditioner, in this pile line, the dimethicone was very high up in the ingredient list, which I was very shocked at. Um, being that with the main choice, they hardly ever use silicones. I don't know if that's something new that they're trying or what, but I'm not with it. Uh, especially when I know that that's not of their caliber, you know? Like, that's not something that they normally do unless I'm missing something. Um, I don't know. But my hair definitely feels really, really soft, which I do like. Um, so, yeah, I'm definitely going to be using that again um, as a co-wash or maybe even like a leave-in. So, now we're going to be using the uh, Exotic Kool-Aid Deep Conditioner. Let's see. Brand new, have not touched it. Smells like mangoes. Smells really nice. Taking my water bottle, y'all. And I'm going in. Open up. You open up. Hit you on, baby, am I? We should be closer than friends. If you open up. Engaging you on my agenda. Request my cherry yet to get ya. Okay, guys, so I just rinsed out the deep conditioner and uh it felt better than all of the other oh my god, I can't even talk. It felt better than most of the other deep conditioners that I've used in the past. Um my hair still doesn't feel as moisturized as it normally does with other deep conditioners but it doesn't feel bad uh, i'm not mad at it i will probably just go ahead and try it on my kids hair that's what i normally do anyway like when stuff doesn't work on me or i don't like the way it feels um my kids have more of a softer grain of hair than i do they have a different texture so I normally just try it in their hair and nine times out of ten it works better in theirs than it does in mine. Um, so that's probably what I'm going to do. Like my hair doesn't feel bad. It feels soft but it just doesn't feel like extra moisturized. Like it doesn't feel like I did a deep conditioner. So 
<sighs> anyway, we're going to try the last product for today, guys. And that is the POW Gel. Okay. Uh, POW In Your Face Finish. OMG. Silky Sealed Cuticles and Extra Shiny. I'll be the judge of that, guys. Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and do a wash and go. Um, haven't done one in a minute. I've just been sticking to twist outs. But I think I'm going to go ahead and do a wash and go. Just because I want to see what this gel is going to do. And then if I don't like it, then I know that this gel is not for me in wash and goes. Because I have had that experience before. Uh, I'm a gel kind of girl. But some gels just don't hold too good for wash and goes. And I have to end up using them for twist outs. Okay uh-huh smells really really good you open up bitch you won't be me we should be closer than friends uh, if you open uh, engaging you on my agenda I'm gonna go ahead and just do a twist out, y'all, because I have somewhere to go tomorrow, uh, so I don't want to risk it because it just looks like it's not going to give me the hold that I need, so I'm not even going to worry about it. guys so I'm back it is the next day and uh, I'm recording with no lights right now uh, I'm just using my phone my phone is charging so uh, I actually like this lighting a little better I'm right by the window this is that natural lighting um, I'm loving it y'all but anyway that's besides the point um, I just wanted to come back and give you guys an update um, my hair was not dry this morning whenever I left to go and handle my business but I let it air dry like I still untwisted it and let it air dry and my hair actually looks really really good the shine is what's amazing me right now like the shine is totally there my hair looks really really good um I'm not liking how my hair is feeling though. My hair kind of feels like um, like it has some residue or something on it. Um, I like the way my hair looks, but I'm not liking the way it's feeling. Uh, so just overall, I'm gonna do a quick little uh, recap. Um, the anti-shedding uh, mocha and molasses, I'm probably gonna have to use this more than once to actually see some results because first time, I wasn't impressed um, didn't really do much I was still shedding and it said it you see results instantly so I didn't see it but I will keep using it just to see what happens um, next was the conditioner I used it as a co-wash I really liked it my hair felt nice my hair felt clean my scalp felt clean uh, my hair was nice and soft nice and slippery I liked it I will be using that again um, this uh exotic kool-aid fruit mask mm, it felt awesome applying it but when i rinsed it out just like all the other ones that i've mentioned in the past when i rinsed it out it felt like i didn't even deep condition and I, and I left it in my hair for over an hour with heat uh so not impressed and finally was the pow gel uh the most part was the shine the shine was totally there but i don't know if maybe i used too much gel because my hair does feel like it has some residue on it um 
so yeah guys that is it one more final look at my hair my hair does look really good though y'all like i'm really really amazed at my hair and how it looks um the twists are very defined the curls are totally there all of that like i said looks really really good uh so i'll probably be using it again i really i really probably will maybe i just won't use as much product so that's it for this video guys thank you guys for tuning in i hope to see you guys on the next one peace